Dear congregation, I would ask you to please turn your very prayerful attention there to Galatians chapter 5. We arrive this morning in the 13th verse of Galatians chapter 5, going through verse by verse, seeking to understand these important truths that the Apostle Paul has been laying out to these Galatian churches that have been infiltrated with false teaching. They have been exhorted by false teachers to go back to ceremonial law, to go back to the law of ceremony, that of sacrifices and circumcision, and the whole thing is unconscionable, isn't it? To imagine that one needs to go back to these sacrifices that were only pointing to the Lord Jesus, or also to imagine in our own hearts and minds that we could ever be justified before an infinitely holy God by the keeping of the moral law. We have broken the law of God. Even in our mother's womb, we came forth speaking lies. There is sin even in the womb. We find Jacob and Esau wrestling, fighting in the womb, even before they were born into this world. Two nations, two people, born, shapen in iniquity, as we have sung there in Psalm 51. We come forth as sinners, having a sin nature, and we cannot keep the moral law to justify us. But Christ is the end of the law for righteousness to all who believe. And it is neither the circumcision of the flesh that will justify a man, 